I'm a meteorologist. Really? So are you on TV? That's awesome. Where can I watch you? Not that kind. See, my degree is actually in forecasting, not broadcast. Okay, so what do you do then? Forecast? I studied meteorology. You studied meteors? I love space! No, not those types of meteors, not space meteors. Uh, well then what kind of meteors? Well, technically anything that falls from the sky is a meteor. So like for example, rain is a... <sighs> I'm a meteorology major. A uh, uh, meteor... what? Meteorology. I study the weather. So your classes are just, what, cloud watching? No, there's actually a lot of math and physics involved. So our classes are very similar to an engineering major, if you can compare it to that. Uh, I'm actually on my way to a differential equations class right now. A, a differential... A, a what? I, I just don't understand. I'm glad I don't take those classes. Okay. I went to school for atmospheric sciences. Oh, so are you a meteorologist? No, atmospheric sciences is a broad umbrella of topics. I'm actually a climatologist. Are you one of those climate change people? No. So you're on TV then? Where can I watch you? I'm a meteorologist. Oh, you're a meteorologist. I wish I could get paid to be wrong half the time. All right. Imagine with me for a second. So the atmosphere is like an ocean or a river, right? So say that we're standing by a river. It's got logs and rocks and roaring water. It's wide, then it's narrow, then it's deep and shallow, and it twists and turns as it goes. Now, imagine I have a football. I'm gonna throw the football into the river and press start on my watch. Now I need you to tell me exactly where the football is going to be in exactly one hour, if it even makes it that far. Now tell me where it's going to be in 24 hours. Doesn't sound so easy, right? Pretty impressive that we meteorologists get it right 50% of the time. My brain hurts. You're still wrong 50% of the time. Hey, you're a meteorologist, right? What type of weather app should I use? Well, in my experience, I found that Radarscope is the best for radar, but if you're looking for an accurate forecast using the Weather Channel app or going to social media to look at your local National Weather Service office or a local meteorologist is best. Well, I just use Apple Weather and <laughs> it seems to work fine for me. Then why'd you ask? Also, Apple Weather said it was going to snow last week. It's June! It's still better than the TV okay. meteorologist. It's supposed to rain today, but I have an event outside. Is there any way you can make it not rain? Are you serious? I'd really like snow. Can you make it snow? I ain't a wizard, Larry. The weather people said a hurricane is coming this way. Can you point a fan at it and blow it somewhere else? Sure. You know what? I got a leaf blower in my garage. <sighs> it is too hot. What good is knowing a meteorologist if they can't make it cooler? I'm gonna throw ice cubes at you! I'm a meteorologist! No way! I love Twister! Is Twister actually accurate? Certain parts of it actually are, but a lot of it isn't. Check out Jim and Caleb reacting to weather movies on YouTube for more than that. Wait a minute. You're telling me that those weather movies are all wrong? I, I love those weather movies. How could you blast them? I mean, you just asked if they were accurate. You can still enjoy the movies. So there you have some things that you hear as a meteorologist that you wish were made up. If I had a dime for every time somebody <laughs> asked me those questions, I would certainly be rich. If you like what you saw today, be sure to leave a like and subscribe down below so you never miss the next Meteorology Monday. Follow us over on all our usual stuff. You know what to do. Until next time, I'm Kayla. And I'm Jim. Thanks for watching. And we'll see you at the next Meteorology Monday.